name's David Buchanan. I'm Professor of Organisational Behaviour at Cranfield University School of Management in the UK. And I've been visiting Adelaide for many years now. It's a great city. You've got a great MBA programme. You've got some great students. Uh, I won't say for how long I've been doing this because it's embarrassing. Um, I teach on the MBA programme. My subject is Management of Change. And I usually deliver that as an intensive programme, uh, normally in the second trimester. Um, the programme has three main components, uh, which I label practice, theory and politics. So for the first part of the programme, we get straight to the doing, to the implementation, and we look at uh, contemporary guidelines, tools, frameworks, diagnostic instruments. That section of the programme is case-based, but the cases that we use are the, are the projects, the programmes, the initiatives that candidates are working on. In other words, we apply those guidelines and, uh, and frameworks to current live projects, not to textbook case studies. That really starts to illustrate the strengths and limitations of some of those tools. Uh, and the aim is to demonstrate that change can be effectively managed through a combination of rational analysis, but also creativity. It's that combination of technique and creativity that makes it work. Second part of the programme we focus on theory and that's dominated by the influential process perspective on change which argues quite simply that change has to be understood and managed uh, as a process not as an event. Um, but through that lens we look at a number of other issues such as problems of spreading innovation, diffusion of innovation, uh, the problem of initiative fatigue and initiative decay, why do even successful changes not sustain, why do they decay? Uh, we look at innovative organisation cultures, how to grow and develop those. And we also look at, um, based on some of my own research, uh, the problems of implementing change after accidents and crises. There's always an investigation. The headlines always say this must never happen again. There's always recommendations, but very often those aren't implemented. So the change doesn't happen. Why not? What's going on there? Uh, organisations are political systems, change is a politicised process uh, and the change leader has to have political expertise um, and be politically skilled. So we spend some time looking at organisation politics, political tactics, the cunning, devious, underhand, manipulative, Machiavellian side of management and change management. Politics is a controversial topic, but my aim is to demonstrate that we can use, have to use political tactics in positive and constructive ways, particularly when driving organisational change. And that's the, that's the third part of the programme. Um, it's a post-experience programme in the main. You have some great candidates with a lot of experience, so my aim is to open that experience, share it around the group. So I use a, a varied range of teaching and learning methods, minimal formal lecture input, uh, a lot of uh, personal reflection, table discussion, uh, diagnostic frameworks, uh, self-assessment, incident analysis, uh, and we also analyse some movie clips, uh, including two or three feature films. We have some fun with this programme.